Hi, this is Steph from DebtFreeSwimming.com and we're here this evening to talk to you about how to lose weight for free. While I'm pregnant, I haven't been able to try to lose so much weight, but before I got pregnant, I was using a lot of free resources that we really want to share with you on how you can lose weight for free as well. Um, we're going to talk about some apps, we're going to talk about some websites, and we're also going to talk about free printables that you can download to use as resources. And to get started this evening, I want to let you know that below this video, I will include the link to our blog post that has all these resources linked for you so that you don't even need to worry about where to go find them. They'll all be on the blog post. And so the first one that we're going to talk about is the, my favorite fitness app on my phone, and that's called MyFitnessPal and also um, Map My Run are my two that I love the most. You can, uh, My Fitness Pal is a free app that you can actually count your calories, you can journal what you're eating, you can log your exercise as well. So My Fitness Pal is probably the basic free weight loss app that everybody uses. I see a lot of my friends on it. It's one of the best ways to track all of those things directly from your phone. And you can even have um, the scanner, some of the, the scan where you can scan uh, items that you're eating and it automatically uploads how many calories are in each serving and you can track your food that way on your phone or your iPad. The second favorite app of mine is called Map My Run and in that app I basically, I have my music on my iPhone, I have the Map My Run app started, I start walking and it actually has like a built-in GPS where it maps where you've walked or run and tells you how many calories you burned and the distance that you went. So that's another great free resource to keep track of if you're walking, jogging, or running outside. Another, or even biking. If you're biking, you could include it on your hip as well. But for the most part, I've used it for walking and running. Another great weight loss website that I want to talk to you about this evening is called Spark People. And uh, maybe you're going to see my kitty in the background tonight. But, and the dogs are back there too whining. But anyways, um, but Matt, my, or, I'm sorry, the other one that I want to talk to you about was Spark People. Spark People was my favorite first weight loss website. It still is. It's free. When you go on to sparkpeople.com, it's a great way to find lots of great information, support, track your exercise, track your food, and also find accountability and support from other people. So sparkpeople.com, mucho grande, recommend that site because it's no cost to you. And it's another great way for you to track what you're eating as well. And also track your exercise, and it's no cost. So that's one of my favorite ones. I also, on the blog post, listed several just great resources and tips from Dr. Oz's website, from WebMD. I kind of have links to all of those great weight loss tips and tools and things that you can do that are free as well. Another thing on the blog post that we talk about are some free printables. Maybe you're somebody that likes to write on your food journal down, write down all those things, and so we have printables there for you as well. We even came up with our own 30-day printable weight loss checklist that you have steps that you can take every day for 30 days to try and lose weight at no cost to you. This is totally free for you to print. Another thing, as I'm going down the blog post, I wanted to talk to you about are just some free exercise tips and tools that you can do at home. Sometimes you don't have the money to join a gym. In our local area, Planet Fitness offers a New Year's special every year where you can sign up for $10 a month. That's $120 a year, which is actually a huge savings compared to most gyms. So check in your local area if you do want to go to a gym and see if there are some New Year's specials that you can take advantage of. I know our local one, people love it because it has free tanning as well. So that's one, one way that you can go. Obviously, other free ways to exercise are running and jogging and walking outside. If you live in an apartment building, walking up and down steps, parking your car farther away, or walking you know, when you're at work, even outside. Um, some of the things that we thought of were you know, biking outside, but if the weather's bad, you can of oftentimes go to a mall. Our local mall has an actual, what they call mall walkers program, where you can walk inside for free and when the weather's bad. So that's a great place as well to go. Um, and walk as well. The other thing that we had thought about was if you're at home and you don't have a lot of weights and things like that, several things you can do. You can use canned food for weights. You can use your body resistance for different ways to lose weight, you know, and, and pushing, doing push-ups, sit-ups, things like that. Just Dance, if you have a Wii, I'm sure you know, you've heard of Just Dance before. Or if you just want to put on your own favorite music and dance, that's another great thing to, you know, do in between walking or using these other resources. Another great thing we thought of was um, that you can check different free sites like FreeCycle, 
You can check Craigslist. Our local area has a great Facebook group where you can find all kinds of free uh, equipment that people either want to get rid of for free or they want to sell. I know for us we were able to get a free uh, exercise bike on freecycle.org. But a lot of times, like I said, that people want to sell exercise equipment for much less. And so that's another great way for you to pick up some really inexpensive things. Another one that we thought about was buying, just buying a workout DVD to keep on hand and rotating your exercise every day. Like we said, if you want to walk at the mall one day, walk outside one day, get on, you know, do an exercise DVD one day, dance one day. Also, getting a step stool and just stepping to your favorite music. If you don't have steps in your house that you can walk up and down to music, you can step on a step stool to your favorite music as well. So these are all just some free exercise tips that we thought of for you, but we had just a couple resources that we really wanted to share because there are so many programs out there you can pay for and really there's a lot you can do for free. So thanks so much for tuning in today and we'll talk to you soon.